Hey everyone, Jeff Teague here. This is the 2024 Venza. As a matter of fact, this is the top of the totem pole, the 2024 Venza Limited in Ruby Flare Pearl. And the Venza Limited is loaded with many cool options. I like that. Let's walk around this one and get a little idea of what Venza is all about here. It's about luxury, Lexus quality, Lexus feel, Lexus comfortability. But sadly, this is the last year for Venza, the 2024 model. It's being replaced. In its place will be the Toyota Crown Signia SUV. We'll be getting a closer look at that very soon. But how do you like Venza? Yes, this might be the perfect time to get a Venza. If you want something that's high quality, luxury, really comfortable seating, good versatility. Frankly, it's a fun vehicle to drive with really good gas mileage. My wife and I each get a little bit lower than 40 and a little bit higher than 40, depending on which one of us is driving. And I'm the lower one. But to be averaging around 40 MPG in this type of vehicle, it's excellent. Oh, look at that. It's a panoramic roof. Really cool, right? Oh, what? What? That is amazing. Performance Fast Facts, woo! This is 219 hybrid horsepower, think RAV4 hybrid, 2.5 liter four cylinder engine with electric motor power. Ooh, this is nice. It's smooth, it's comfortable, it is a great, great ride. I think you should try it just to see what you think. And then it also has electronic on-demand all-wheel drive, electronically controlled CVT. The on-demand, it works like a front wheel drive, so the front wheels power everything until you get wheel slippage or lose traction, then power set to the back wheel, so they're all doing the same work. Hi, have you met Ted? This is Fuel Facts, 14.5 gallon fuel tank here, fuel doors on the driver's side, and then 40 in the city, 37 on the highway, 39 combined. That's solid, my friends. Four wheel disc brakes and smooth and responsive multi-link rear suspension. One disadvantage to filming today is my face. It looks pasty white like I'm Casper the Friendly Ghost. Well, I'm still friendly. It's just one of those things I have to work with, so sorry about that. The lighting is horrible. We switched over to some dimmer lighting. A little bit of darkness will give us what we want to see because we want to see those daytime running lights, the headlights here, and we also want to see the fog lights, but we also don't want to see that sun's reflection on me. I look like Casper the Friendly Ghost. It just whites me out, so that's better, I guess. Yeah. This is such a unique, quirky vehicle here. I love the projector headlights. That's why I want to show it up close. Got the vents here and they are functional. If you notice there's, see the light? That means they're functional, there's airflow. All right, look at this here. The LED fog lights and we've got chrome, matte black on the grill. This is one of the most unique pieces. This is almost like something you'd see on an EV vehicle, just trying to be the funkiest, the quirkiest, the weirdest vehicle of all, but I have learned to like it. Look at that. That's pretty cool, right? Plain. Ooh, that's a cool one. This is Toyota Safety Sense 2.5 plus. Look at those 19 inch wheels. It's pretty cool, right? And then look at this. Turn signal indicator in the side mirror, window cutout so you can see around that ruby flare pillar, blind spot monitor. Right there, that's where the Toyota technology is in all the vehicles. Got some matte black cladding at the bottom. And this has four-way auto lock and unlock. You can tell by those parallel lines right there. And that also works for the back tailgate, which we found out is foot operated. If you wanna use your foot, put your foot into it. All right, here we go. Look, this is our moonroof. This is our panoramic moonroof. No, this is our Stargaze fixed panoramic roof. So it doesn't open but you can change it between clear and frosted. Frost yourself. Here we go. Frosty, the panoramic roof. Da 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 da. Look at the turn signal down here. That's interesting. Two exhaust ports. And then I love that LED strip all the way across. That's neat. That is really neat, my friends. Also, the backup camera is right here. And the digital rear view mirror camera is right here. So look at that. That is hidden, and what we have here, it's right there. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Look at that. That's pretty neat. We've got JBL speakers, the tonneau cover if you want to hide things. It's got a little light right there, and then 
Get in here, baby. Come on. Come on, player. Ooh, spare tire. Nice. A little bit of soundproofing over there. Do you like it? <sighs> Sweep the leg. No, Sensei. Sweep the leg. Oh, no. Oh, no. Mr. Miyagi to the rescue. And now, whoosh, that's how you recreate the Karate Kid ending. Let's explore some backseat features here. Look at this, soft touch panel, that's huge. When you have soft touch panels, a lot of times that indicates high quality materials. Faux wood grain, looks nice though, I like the light color. We've got two seat pockets, so see, Toyota engineers put two seat pockets in there, that's nice. Here's our room in the back, and then this is with the seats down mostly flat. This is the vent right here that keeps the hybrid battery cool. So you wanna, on road trips, make sure that that is unobstructed. Try to keep blankets, pillows, stuffed animals away from it over long times. Here you go, just keeps it cool. All right, nice, nice materials here with the cup holder, with the armrest, tile latches right there. The seats are very, very comfortable. I gotta tell you that. There's good leg room, good headroom, I think. I love the lighting here. That's nice. USBs there, temperature, and then this view. Ooh, that's nice. And how do we do for leg room and headroom in the back? Well, this is with the seat all the way back and recline, selfish driver, right? Maybe Kareem Abdul-Jabbar or Wilt Chamberlain are sitting there. Then we've got this right here, Shaquille O'Neal. Shack. All right, look at this. Still got leg room. My five foot eight still has some headroom here. That's good. The seats, oh, they're so plush. So plush. And then this is with the seat forward, just a little bit more, but it's really good space and my face is really white. As we look in the passenger side, let's talk about soft tech seating. This is soft tech material. It's synthetic leather, but it's very forgiving. It's easy to clean, very soft and plush. Holds up over time keeps cooler when it's hot out, and it doesn't soak up stains as much, so it's more resistant. A lot of benefits to Softex. Here we go. That's really, really nice. The power seat adjusts very quickly. Do you like the pattern? Do you like the stitching? And then this right here, this is a $1,400 option, the Stargaze fixed panoramic roof. One thing you need to know is it has to be turned on as I just found out. Duh, you should know that Jeff. Yes, now when you push the button it switches between clear and I don't think you can see any difference here. Well, hold on. Look, we're seeing this. Now let's go over here. We're going to test this. Why not? Okay, it's frosted. Can you see? Oh yeah, look at that. That's cool. So you can't see you can see. Nice. How do you like that? Soft touch panel right here. You just want to kind of rest your hand in it. Just kind of molds in. It reminds me if I'm a kid at the science center, I put my hand on it. You feel it kind of settle in. It's like quicksand. No, it's soft materials though. It feels good. 12.3 inch screen here. Wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. That's nice. Very easy to use. Voice commands so you can get places find out information, change your temperature, change your radio station, you can swipe, pinch, zoom, all that jazz, real easy to use. And I love this digital display right here so that you can just kind of turn on the air and look at that, very high quality. I love this right here. This is one of my favorite heating and cooling systems in any Toyota. Look at all those USBs. And then different driving modes, we've got EV, Eco, Normal, Sport, Push Button Start. The wood grain trim accents are very nice in here, actually. We got heated, we got cooled. Boom, I like that. All right, look at this. Little tray for long cups. Woo, that's nice. 12 volt circular there. Pop that right in there, like we did. Boom. Do we have memory seats? check. Do we have power mirrors? Double check. Nice. Double shock power. All right. Look at that. Big opening for bottles right here. 
little pocket for whatever, little pocket for whatever. And then lumbar support is added to the driver's side. Nice bolstering and look, it's very comfortable. You want to squeeze that Charmin. It's nice. Do we have a power steering wheel? Of course we do and it operates very quickly. Toyota technology for moving power seats and things like that used to be very slow, very blah, 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 turtle-like. Now it's quick. So they've really improved there. Hood release, fuel release. And then we've got our, ooh, heated steering wheel, holla. I really like this 360 view camera. That's cool, man. I like the view. Do I like it in reverse? Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah, look at that. Does it work in the front? It will if I push this button. There we go. Look at that, you can guide yourself into the parking spot and stop perfectly. These are our drive modes. Sport, normal, eco, which one do you like? That's pretty cool, we'll do better gas mileage. Let's honk the horn. All right, these controls right here control a lot of your music, your radar cruise control, your lane centering, features like that. And then we've got, ooh, voice commands. You can also just say, hey, Toyota. Hey, Toyota. How can I help you? Increase the driver's temperature. Setting the driver's temperature to 63 degrees. Oh, see, that's nice. Yeah, we could do that. That's right. This is 12.3 inch digital screen. You use this right here. Hold it down to get your settings. And then you can go between the middle panel, the left panel, the right panel, vehicle settings. That's where you hold that OK button down in the steering wheel, dynamic radar, cruise control, power back door. Do you want it on or off? Do you want it hands free? That's the kick. Hands free, when it says hands free, that means kick. All right, look at this, meter settings. Meter type, do you want this one? Do you want this one? Or do you want this one? I want the two panel, because that's what I always like. And then we can go with our meter style. How do you want the look to be? What's your feel, what's your flavor? Flavor, flav, tough or sporty. In my car, in my crown, I'm on sporty right now, but I'm gonna change it to smart, I think, because I like the blue. That's pretty neat. So what else can we do? Let's hold it down. You can do messages. That's for radar cruise control, lane centering. Ooh. You do the walk of life, hey, you do the walk of life. Do, 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 woohoo. Pretty neat, right? All right, head up display is right here. Get our information. It'll show the adaptive cruise control, the lane centering, things like that, how fast we're going, what gear we're in, all that jazz. I believe it does turn by turn navigation as well. All those things that you can do with your vehicle. <laughs> Very nice. Uh, and then we could just find different pieces of information. Energy flow, this one tells you when it's using gasoline, when it's using electric and when it's recharging your battery. And then some things I always show in my videos here is how you can change the sound tuning. Just go to that, that, maybe a little bit of bass. It's all about the bass, about the bass. And then we can go back here. You can vehicle customize, change what you have about your doors. And then we'll go to the other one that you should know. That's the, I guess, it's, is it vehicle customize? Okay, yeah, that's the one. That's the one then. Oh, general, date and time. That's how you change daylight savings time. It goes from 7.12 to 8.12. We wanna be at 8.12, because that's when we're filming. We're getting here early, baby. Woo! Digital rear view mirror. So look, look at that. Clean view. Or do you want this view right here? Or do you want this view? You want this view. All right. And you can change that right here by going across. You can change the settings as you want them. Home link for garage door openers. Lights, lights, 
safety connect, the SOS panic button, and that's how you hit the clear versus the frosted, and this is your panel. Nice. Lighted mirror with sliders. That's a microphone for the passenger, the co-pilot, and that's a one for the driver. It's one for the driver. It's one for the driver. Yeah. I've got a window sticker. That must mean I can tell you how much these cost and what standard on a limited Venza. They're made in Japan. Has really good safety ratings, really good fuel mileage. Good specs across the board, honestly. Very few things I don't like about this car. Just take a look at these features and see what you like. Nine JBL speakers. Stargaze. So it starts at 43215. Special color added to it for the Ruby 1400 for the Stargaze. Then we've got some options that were added at the regional assembly port. Right here. And then this one is 48. 559 it's available at Fred Anderson Toyota. You can go to fredandersontoyota.com. They work local or long distance. fredandersontoyota.com. Thanks for being here for Venza Talk. Are you sad to see the Venza go? Do you want to scoop one of these up before they're gone? I love this car. It looks fantastic in ruby flare pearl. I'm so sorry that this one's going away. I'm excited to see what the Crown Signia SUV or crossover SUV is going to have we're gonna find out real soon, lots of information about that one. Believe me, and I'm gonna bring it to you. Woo, watch the channel. Thanks very much. I'm at Toyota Jeff Reviews, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, and Facebook, and I'm at Auto Jeff Reviews, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, and Facebook, and I hope to see you on both my channels. Thanks. If you wanna learn more about Toyota Venza, click the Venza playlist so you can get all the information, all the videos, all the resources you need to learn more about your favorite SUV. Thanks everybody, see you soon.